Hello everybody, today I'm going to be repping my favorite book and giving you guys a little inside look at it and telling you guys why you should read it. So my favorite book is called Season of Life by Jeffrey Marks, by Jeffrey Marks, and uh, the book is about, um, Jeffrey Marks has a friend, his name is Joe Ehrman, and Joe Ehrman played for a uh, defensive tackle for the Colts in the NFL, and he was the captain for their team, and he was a really good player, um, and so now he's a coach, he's also a minister as well. But he's in the book, he's coaching the Gilman Greyhounds, and his friend, the author, Jeffrey Marks, follows him through uh, a season. And uh, the theme of the book is being a man. So I know you guys are thinking right now, you're probably thinking that being a man, that's the theme, and it's a football book. So uh, it's probably just about the coach telling guys to toughen up and being tough to play football and not being soft, being a tough, macho football player. And that could be further from the truth. Um, Ehrman uh, is a high school coach because he knows he can turn boys into men. And that's a big period for uh, that. That's when boys turn into men is in high school. And he believes that men are created through relationships. And he believes men are created through a common cause or through a cause in their life. And the cause is usually making the world a better place or making their mark on the world. And uh, relationships... Uh, he stresses like have you have a relationship with love can you be loved are you loving and do people love you are you are you a loved person if you're not then you're not a man um and uh, if you think about it that's what makes this book so great is because it follows the gilman greyhound the football team coached by joe Ehrman, and uh and a team is basically football team has 40 to 50 guys so a lot of relationships within a team and they do have a one common cause, and that is to win games and be the best team possible. Ehrman takes a different approach. In the book, the mission of the team is to make the world a better place, and, and uh, whether that's winning games or not. Um, Ehrman believes that you have to, to be a man, you have to uh, have, be responsible, and you have to uh, attack leading. You have to be a leader, but you have to lead courageously. Um, he uses big words that... Um, like integrity, a man has to have integrity, a man has to have empathy, a man has to be responsible, and you have to be a courageous leader because at the end of the day, that's what men do. Men men should lead their families. Men should be great fathers. You have to ask yourself, how are you being as a son? How are you as a father? How are you as a husband? How are you at leading your family? And that's great because I know that because I play football, but I always knew that like football taught me life lessons, but in this book, you see the real life lessons, and this book can change your life. Um, it talks about leading so much, and how Joe Ehrman leads, and how it rubs off on his players, and how I'm going to lead next year has changed, because I'm, I'm next year is my senior year, so I'm already going to be designated and looked at as someone who's going to lead the team. So that my mindset has totally been changed because of this book, and I'm very thankful that I read this book. And this book can change your life, even if you're not a football player. Even if you're not a man, um, it can just give you life lessons. Like, you know, if you're man, woman, whatever you identify as, it will give you a kind of a blueprint of if I want to be successful and I want to be looked at as someone who people like and someone who people respect and who people look at and be like, that person does lives the right way. You should read this book because it teaches you. You have to lead courageously. You have to have empathy. You have to have integrity. And uh, it, it's a lot of maturing in this book. I would say there are some negatives. Um, the negatives is it follows the team throughout the season, but you don't really create, get emotionally attached to the players yet in the book. All you do is you kind of follow Coach Joe, Coach Ehrman, and how he talks to his players and how he gets them to uh, turn from boys into men. And it's actually really cool because you get to see how Someone he, he played in the NFL, he played for some great coaches, but he attacks everything differently than what those other coaches did. He uh, shows more love, more respect to his players. He doesn't say things like toughen up, be a man, play football, you're supposed to be tough. He has real, real conversations with them, and I was really appreciative of that. And I think this book can really, really change your life, and uh, I really recommend you reading it. Read it. Thank you.